Hello beautiful people, welcome back to my channel. It's the one and only Divas World. I don't know what that is. Y'all don't mind that. Anyways, like this short do. Stay tuned if you want to find out where I got this unit and what it is, what she called. But anyways, I'm here for another wig review. So the wig that I have, unfortunately, I don't have the stock card, but it is a really beautiful unit that is going around. And y'all have probably seen it out there. I saw it. Who was it? The first time I saw the color was on Celebrity on Instagram. And I just really love that yellow. But luckily, I didn't have to go buy my buy a Brazilian wig and do the whole water dyeing to get it. Which a lot of people have done and it looks beautiful on them. But thank the Lord that somebody out there decided to make a synthetic wig that looks similar to it. And when I saw it on the lovely one and only Trendy K, I knew I had to get my hands on it. And so I have this lovely, lovely, gorgeous unit. This a mustard yellow. I don't know. The camera is not giving this mustard yellow any justice. It just looks like a blonde unit. But trust and believe, you guys, this is mustard yellow. Trust and believe, guys. This is not no other blonde unit. This is a mustard yellow. I don't know why it's picking up like that, but when I look in my mirror, I see mustard yellow. And for some reason, this camera is giving y'all blonde. This is not a blonde unit. Hopefully I can get a picture and put it on there so y'all could see that this is a beautiful, gorgeous, true yellow. Just trust me. <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to rock it like this, though. When I wanted it, I want it straight. It looks beautiful on other people when it's as it is. But I'm probably going to go in and straighten it and, and rock it. It comes with lace from ear to ear that I have not cut out yet. It has two small combs at the top, one at the bottom. Of course, adjustable straps, which I rarely use and it's you know it's soft it has it has some well it feels thick to me hopefully it's the same when I pop it on my head so first is first I'm probably gonna just go ahead and cut out the lace and come back and show y'all ta-da so here is how she looks. This is all the hair to the front. It's a little bit light, I would say, but I don't mind it. I feel like it's enough. It's enough and it's a nice, it feels yakky to me. I just wanna unravel these curls cause they're not. They're not my cup of tea. And it's just, it feels really good though. It's a nice feel. Of course, we have the tangling coming on. And in time, it will get worse to, to detangle, but it's not so bad right now. I have not worn her. I just got her, I think, like last week, but I don't know where I'm going to wear her at, but... straighten her out and call it a day hi uh, so here it is the final look I like it I like it straight better it suits me better than 
what the original state was and I'm trying to get a good picture to put on my gram or to post on here so you guys can really see that mustard true yellow. I'm looking in the mirror. It really does look like um really really like a 613 but I wish it was a little bit more true yellow but it ain't bad I'm not gonna complain I love it see I've straightened it and it has layers I never cut that maybe eventually I might cut it that short but for now I'm gonna enjoy her as she is and if I ever decide to rock her out, I'll do an update of her in like true, like true, like outside. But till then, thank you guys for watching. Catch y'all on the next hair review.